What's going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel. So, it's been about 13 to 14 hours since news broke that Jonathan Majors was arrested yesterday for on accounts of strangulations, assault, and harassment, which we now know is Jonathan Majors' wife. From the reports that I've heard and read is that they were getting in a confrontation. She saw that he was getting a message from another woman and so he tr she tried to snag away the phone and he stopped her, probably strangled her and assaulted her. We don't know the whole context about this. So that is what is being reported and I just wanted to share my thoughts and feelings about this. Uh, when I first saw this article pop up on my Facebook, I thought it was a joke. You know, sometimes we see memes and things, especially when it revolves around uh, Keanu Reeves saying that women have come came up and accused him of being a nice person. When I read that Jonathan Majors was arrested or accused, I thought that my first thought was that it was a joke, you know? But then I started reading headlines and started reading on deadline and going on different various pages and it turned out to be factual. It breaks my heart because like I mentioned right now he is on top of the world. We just saw him present at the Oscars with Michael B. Jordan. He's in Creed 3 which he is phenomenal in. He was in Ant-Man and the Wasp Quantumanium. Say what you want about that movie but I think he was a great performer in that film. Never seen Lovecraft Country but he was also in Devotion last year. And just reading the article and reading what's being reported. Now this is what I'm now this is not me saying that I was there. I don't know the full context of this story. But I'm hoping that this is not true. Because I want to believe that this guy is fantastic on and off the screens. However, we don't know people outside of the work. And so this is why I'm really hoping that this is not true. I hope that this is something that is being made up. But from the looks of it, it might not be. Um, but if it is true, there are going to be serious problems moving forward. And... It just came to a shock to me because it doesn't he doesn't seem like that type of person and I am one to not put hands on anybody man or woman and this was just a big shock to me when I read the news and saw it now we're all going to the assumption from what we're reporting is that it's true but I'm really hoping that it's not true uh, but if it is um, I hope that this guy never gets work again because even though I am a big fan of Jonathan Majors in Ant-Man and the Wasp Quantumanium and in Creed 3, mostly the latter, um, it doesn't matter if you're good on screen. This is going to be a bigger issue moving forward, especially with him being casted as Kang in the MCU and a movie about Kang coming in 2024, I believe, 2025. So that's going to be having huge ramifications. But if it's not true, then thank God, uh, because I don't want it to be true. But if it is true, I hope this guy never gets uh, work again. I've never heard anything bad of him off screen. There's never been any bad headlines with this guy. And just seeing this, this is why it's so shocking is because we've never seen anything bad happen with Jonathan Majors. This is the first major thing that is really big and really disturbing to hear and read about. So I'm really hoping that it's not true, but if it is true, I really hope that this guy doesn't get any work again because that is just not right. No matter the situation, that is something that you don't do at all. You don't lay a hand on women. That is something that is 100% like a big no-no. You don't even lay a hand on a man. You don't lay hands on anybody. Keep your hands to yourself. Uh, but I don't know. It's been hard to ponder the news and 
I don't know how it's going to move how it's going to be moving forward because I planned on watching Creed 3 again. After reading this news, I don't know if that's going to happen. Um but yeah, it's this is something hard to believe. But it's always wait until proving guilty or otherwise. Um so we're going to be keeping an eye on what happens, what progresses moving forward. But I'm really hoping that this doesn't turn out to be true. Uh, if it does, it's going to overshadow everything that he's been working on and is going to be working on. It's just... Now, this is going to me on the, on the assumption that I don't know anything. I was not there physically, so I cannot say what actually happened. But of course, his reps are saying that he did nothing wrong and they're going to prove his name. They're going to clear his name. So, we're going to see what happens. But, what are your guys' thoughts on this? Go ahead and drop your thoughts in the comments below. And I'll catch you guys on the flip side.